it's kind of a leap of faith, but it's worked out very well for me this first round. And I was at home because of COVID, so I actually had the time, which I don't usually have. So I had about 18 months, and after about uh, three or four of those, I was used to being on the road and not ever being here. So it was, I guess, just an, an opportunity since I was home. It seemed like a good time to do it. Lori Bowen has been living in Hot Springs for most of the last 10 years. In those 10 years, she noticed that Hot Springs did not have a good local running store where, where people could buy things like running shoes, running apparel, or running fuel. So in 2020, Lori decided that she was going to open her own running store. It was an unmet need in Hot Springs. We've got a true, or a huge trail running community, um, road running community, and it was an unmet need. in downtown, downtown Hot Springs, that made sense to me, but um, falling into a location that is two doors down from the pancake shop is fantastic because every morning there are customers standing outside waiting on pancakes and they come in and they shop and they stay warm or cool depending on the weather and um, just it's a good way for them to pass time. The traffic, the foot traffic in front of this store every single day. Um, everyone, when you think of Hot Springs, you just think of historic downtown Hot Springs. So um, for me, it was just a no-brainer when the opportunity um, to find this space became available. It just made sense because we're right here in the middle of, of all of the, the tourists and the public walking. For me, it's been getting inventory. Um, everything else, um, yeah, I won't say it came easily, but um, I had a, a lot of great help. Opening a first business in a pandemic took guts. What takes even more is opening a second one just two years later. Here and a lot of product in this one small store and we just need more space. So the next one is going to be, it's going to be called Trail Mix and it's just going to be trail running. I have an amazing staff and when I'm not here, they just handle it. So they are the reason that this place runs. And the staff only have good things to say about Lori. And I have actually been friends for, I don't know, quite a few years, so I enjoy working with my friend. We have a good time together. We are very dog friends. We have Snowball, and we have Louie and Libby, and we have uh, Chicken Nugget, and uh, we just, there's always a dog in here. In fact, I'm the boring one because people will walk during the week, they'll come by and say, hey, are the dogs here today? <laughs> nope, sorry, just me. <laughs> um, I wanted it to be all things running, uh, road running, trail running, and I wanted it to be outdoor hiking, all of the things you want to do outside. And we have just outgrown the space. It's been successful. Um, we've got, you know, I mentioned before, all the foot traffic, a lot of people in and out. Of Yeah, it's concerning. <laughs> okay. You're gonna have to edit that. Uh, Lori, here. Yeah. <laughs>